What up everyone, Reege here for Animal Wire, and if it looks like a caterpillar, walks like a caterpillar, it's probably a caterpillar. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, maybe it's a bird. The Cenarius mourner to be more precise, and the babies to be even more er, er, precise. Because when these little guys are just wee nestlings, they partake in some marvelous mimicry. So first, let me show you some of the crazy critters that inspire them. As you can see, they're orange, they're hairy, and they're kinda cute, right? Wanna touch it? Oh hells no, these caterpillars are lathered in a highly irritating toxin. Although, that lush head of hair sure is tempting. But we know better and so do all the other animals in the area. That's how they've kept on all this time. And what's good for the goose must be good for the gander. Check it out. Bright orange downy feathers? Check. Hair like filaments? Check. Bleach white tips, yep, and just about the size of a caterpillar from head to toe. Beautiful, it appears our little doppelganger here has decked himself out in all the latest insect larvae fashions. Something that in and of itself is a pretty nice accomplishment, so don't lose your cool when I tell you the charade doesn't end here, and is supported by a most unusual behavior. Yeah, the way it swivels its head from side to side gets me every time. It's so eerily reminiscent of that hairy caterpillar, and really, could it be anything different? Well, if you're not entirely convinced, know this kind of motioning only seems to be triggered in the presence of a perceived threat. As the difference between maturing enough to leave the nest and dying young usually boils down to not being eaten. The rate of depredation is shockingly high, but thankfully when the coast is clear, these youngins are able to kick back a bit and do as normal baby birds like to do. Cause let's not forget, there will come a time when all that gorgeous orange fades to black and any interest in doing the caterpillar dance will be gone. This ain't Neverland, kids. You're all going to die, eventually. So this time it was Andrea Volpe who sent this story in. Always appreciate the help. And with that being said, yo dude, sweet creature.